What's up, Long Beach? Welcome back to LBPostSports.com. It's JJ. It's Thursday night in the mid, and it's Long Beach State hosting the UC Irvine Ant Eaters. Long Beach State surfing into this one, still tied for first in the Big West with Cal State Northridge, and it's senior night, and it's especially nice to see D Mo in the jersey instead of on the sideline in the suit. Uh, but it's gonna be up to TJ Robinson and the other freshmen to get it done in this one, the youngsters, uh, because it was them who needed to get it done when Demo sat out his first game at Irvine. They gotta take care of business at home tonight as they hit the road for the final three games of the season straight from the jump. It was Long Beach State hitting their shots from the outside and especially Steph Gilling, two for three from behind the arc, but there would be more of Steph later on. And wouldn't you guess it? UC Irvine was hot from the outside too. This is becoming a bad a pattern for the Long Beach State 49ers, giving up the three, especially early, to Pacific, to Fullerton, to Green Bay, Wisconsin. Here to Michael Hunter, who does his best Jody Meeks impression right there from about 30 feet. Hunter went four for six from behind the arc for 14 points. Irvine actually built a bit of a lead, but Long Beach State got back into it with some good passing and TJ Robinson used that good passing and turned it into points. TJ went four for six from the field. Nice little move right there. Eight points, uh, well on his way to uh, dominating the paint, which he did. That and one right there got the beach especially back in it. Down one at half, and even though they were losing, the Long Beach fans did not lose their spirit. Dancing in the aisles they were. <laughs> Coming out of halftime, it was time for some Weiss. Mr. Weiss, that is, the freshman down low, Eric Weiss, Number 34 for the Ant Eaters. They kept going to him. It's not that he was playing incredible, but they just kept going to him. They feed him 13 points in the second half for Weiss. But like I said, Steph Gilling. Hot like a broken stove. Hotter than Barstow in August. Found his wing position and just drained him. Drain, drain, drain. 17 points in the second half for Steph. But this play right here is how, much, how far Steph has come. He could have gone up with that three right there, but he didn't. And guess what? Gets it back. Money. Growing up, 23 a game high. The Maniacs love it, as they should. But Weiss went back to work. They got him the ball, he got in the lane, and he got to the free throw line. Shot eight free throws in the second half. Some of these calls may be a little bit questionable, but you got to give the big man down low the credit. However, Long Beach State, like I said, some of the best passing of the season tonight. 18 assists for the Niners. Irvine thoroughly frustrated with how the Niners ran away with this one in the second half, building a 10-point lead, but they couldn't, they couldn't separate because Irvine is so good from downtown, and even if they're not good from downtown, we foul them from downtown, hit three free throws right there, another three, hit another free throw, a quick seven points, all of a sudden they're within three, but Long Beach State with about 40 seconds left, tap, tap, tap a -roo foul on Steph. Steph steps to the line and shouldn't it be Steph that puts in the winning points. 75 at 74. Long Beach State wins it and it's time to honor those seniors. I mean this senior class Cornell Williams, Brian Freeman, Mo Clady, Donovan Morris. These guys have seen it all. They went from the NCAA tournament to a a really tough season last year and then to this year where they they put all the all the expectations aside and just played some great basketball. This group will always be special to me because of the fact that three of these guys when I first got the job here almost two years ago everybody told them you don't want to go there they got nobody back this isn't the place for you they're not going to win and those three came in here and believed in us they believed in Long Beach State and they believed in this program Niners hopefully going to ride this momentum as they hit the road to take on Northridge at Cal Poly and ending the season at UC Santa Barbara.